and connect the negative of the capacitor to the negative rail. Connect 100 ohms resistor to pin 3. Connect the opposite side to the anode of the LED and connect the cathode of the LED to the negative rail. Place BD139 on the breadboard, then connect the opposite of the resistor to the base of the BD139. Connect the emitter to the negative rail. Place the relay switch on the breadboard. Connect the coil of the relay switch to the positive rail then connect the opposite coil to the collector of BD139 connect AC-DC line to the common pin of the relay switch and you can connect the output load from the normal open pin of the relay switch Place the momentary switch on the breadboard, then connect one side terminal to the middle of the capacitor and the resistor, then connect the opposite side to pin 2 and pin 6, then connect the diode in between the two pin of the coil of the relay switch. Now, let's see on my breadboard. <laughs> 